One of my commitments in starting uh, the Pit Pair Ocean Racing team was that not only did I want to raise my own performance and create a, a British-based high performing team, but I wanted to leave some sort of change behind me that would make it easier for others to follow a pathway into this high performance sport. Um, in 2020, I teamed up with the medtech company Aparito. You can see their logo on the mast just there. And we designed a small experiment that would track some of my physical and mental health data during the three months it took for me to race around the world. Now, the reason we did this is when we were trying to research into things like how many calories I would need to eat a day while I was sailing around the world, there just wasn't any information out there. So through my whole career, I've been feeling my way. Um, and although there is information out there about other endurance sports, most of it relates to men and most of it relates to athletes that are younger than me. Um, so we were kind of just having to break our own ground in terms of understanding um, some of the physical elements of what happens to my body over three months of racing. Um, so with Aparito, we sample data continuously from things like my heart rate, how many calories I was eating, how much I was sleeping. I did some cognitive tests throughout the race to understand my mental clarity and speed. Um, and after a lot of hard work, all of that research has been turned into a scientific paper, which has been published in the Journal of Sports Medicine. Massive thank you and well done to Sandra at Aparito and to our own Lou Adams, who put a lot of work and effort into this. Um, it's only a small, small, small sample of information, but maybe it's the start of building a body of knowledge that will help progress sailing across all fields for all people in the future but might also make it easier for other people starting on this road um, to becoming offshore ocean racing sailors in the future.